Welcome to Real Life Aaron. This is Real Life and I am Aaron. I'm in the old farts room. Right, you old fart? Yeah, you shouldn't be, really. No, I know I shouldn't be. But look, the cat is eating some stir-fried chicken. <laughs> Dad's thrown it out for the birds. The cat's not stupid. He's got in there. He's jumped straight on it. So I haven't woken up with like a sore throat or a cough or runny nose or anything, but I was really sweaty in bed last night. I was shivering. And I've got a swollen gland still. And I looked online, apparently it takes two to four weeks to go down. Oh, it's like a, it's like a, do you know like when you get a bruise and you press it, that's sort of, that's how much it sort of hurts. Well, I guess I just got to not press it. I am in a good mood. I've just weighed myself this morning and I am like just below 73 kilos. That is mad. My target was 70 kilos and I think I'm on course for it. I can't believe that I'm able to eat pizzas and sweets and chocolates and still be losing weight. Like, that's super good. Like, how? How has that happened? Right now, I'm in my car, ready to go shopping. I'm actually going to do my Christmas shopping. Yes, it is, like, still September, and I'm not one of these people that supports Christmas this early on, but I'm going to be going away for Christmas. So, I'm... Oh, obviously, as if I've never mentioned that. Um, but yeah, I'm not gonna have time to do it, like in December and things. Usually I would do it in December, not gonna be here in December. Um, so yeah, I need to start going and do my shopping now. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna wrap the presents up um, and I'm gonna leave them maybe in my bedroom or something. And then on Christmas day, um, my parents can allocate the presents to whoever I buy the presents for. Well, at least it's a nice day for it. I only ended up going to one shop for now, and it was super, super successful. I managed to get so many good stuff for Christmas for the kids. Um, for, like, my brother and sister, I managed to get a couple of bits, but I think I'm going to get them some stuff online. But, yeah, I managed to get around that shop. I spent a lot less than I thought I was going to spend, and I got a decent amount of stuff. I've got all the wrap wrapping paper and everything. I was going to take you around the shop and show you what I was getting um, and things like that, but... Then I figured that if they watch these videos, then they're going to see what they're getting. So it's not going to be a surprise. So yeah, that failed. But I also managed to get myself some lunch. Look at these rice crackers. They're sweet chili. Um, gluten free as well. So uh, yeah, I'll chomp on a load of them in a minute because I haven't had anything to eat today. And it's already midday. Mm. That one's nice. We've got some people around. Little did I know that my sister and my mum had organised a Macmillan Cancer Awareness um, morning. So, like, I say morning, it's actually afternoon, but they, they've called it a morning. It's coffee and cake. Um, and you donate. You put, like, we've got, like, a money pot, and you're putting money into the uh, Macmillan Cancer Research uh, pot for charity and help yourself to cakes and, and coffee. So that's good because we're raising money for cancer, obviously. So... That's cool, but I didn't know everybody was going to be coming around. So, yeah, it's kind of cool to see everyone. But um, I've eaten a little bit of cake, and I feel bad for it now. I now officially suck at this game. Look at my record. 22 wins, 3 draws, and 21 losses. Whoa, what happened there? Oh, my TV doesn't like that. But, yeah, that was good earlier. That was like, I, I had it really good. I had it up to about 18 wins with about 6, 7 losses. And then all of a sudden, bang. I've changed my tactics, I've changed my players, and he's back in the game, lads. 9-1, that's my best ever win on FIFA 20. Ladies and gents, another day, another dollar. It is Saturday evening now. Um, I've been to work. Didn't vlog anything when I came home. Don't know why, just didn't. Um, currently watching Man City beating Everton, 2-1. Also, on the football today, I actually won some money, which I'm. it's the first time I've won some money for a long time. And I had a good day at work, didn't finish early, but I earned some bonus at work. So I got an early finish last shift. I got some bonus money this shift. I've won some money on the football and I've got money on for tomorrow. So everything's looking positive. I'm off again. This was my last day of the week because I'm off again tomorrow. Um, we're going down to Bournemouth to watch Russell Howard, me, my dad and my brother. So that should be super sick. But uh, tonight, again, I'm just going to chill out. It is actually a run night tonight, but I'm thinking of skipping it because... It got dark pretty quick, the weather was awful, and I think I'm just using that as a lazy-ass excuse, to be honest. But I'm not feeling a run right now. Obviously, my niece is staying around at the moment. She woke me up a couple of times during the night, and I start to realise now how having a kid or living with a kid or a baby makes you tired. 
Didn't know that. Know it now. Just your average Sunday morning in a Blandford household. And today is the first day that I've actually started to notice. I'm losing a bit of weight off my face. Like, I can see the cheeks. My cheeks are like... I don't know, can you see it? I can see it. That's good. Also, I'm having a really good hair day today. Mind you, I haven't put any gel on it yet. That's just water and flicked over to the side. But that is pretty much how I want to wear my hair. I've just got out of the shower and I'm not going to start blowing my own trumpet. But actually, I kind of am because I've deserved it. This top used to be tight on me. Look how baggy it is. And these trousers, look how back. Whoa, that's a dangerous shot. But look how baggy they are. That's definitely a weird shot. And I'm always wearing the same clothes as well when I go out because I have a wardrobe full of clothes. And in fact, let me show you. So this wardrobe here, basically my room's an absolute tip. But this, this wardrobe here is like the clothes that I wear to work. Like I've got a few, few high-vis tops in there. Um, I've got some hats and things up there. But yeah, that's basically just like some old t-shirts and things that I wear to work. Um, and in my wardrobe, it's absolutely packed. Oh, uh, in my wardrobe, it's absolutely packed with shirts, um, polo shirts, t-shirts, a couple of jumpers and things like that. Um, and there's some trousers and that in the bottom. But I also have another big pile of clothes on the floor over there because I don't have room for them in the wardrobes. Um, and I just end up not going into the wardrobes and just wearing the clothes that I've got in the pile on the floor. <laughs> it's a big vicious circle really, but it just means that I wear the same clothes around and around and again. Here we have a little girl called Evie tearing up the place. And three, two, one, bang, the bomb's gone oh, off. so funny, I missed the bus. Um, my sister's still here because she's had her tonsils taken out and she's reaping the benefits with this one running around trashing the place. Look at her big feet. Look at her big feet. <laughs> and just before I pack my overnight bag, I'm going to pack a little overnight bag, just some boxes and some socks and stuff. Um, we got to wait for my brother because he's coming back from China. Is he coming straight here from the airport? <laughs> oh, he was home yesterday. Okay, so he's come home from China yesterday. And uh, yeah. Um, he's heading around here, and then we're going to head off to Bournemouth. Borny mouth. Oh yeah, and I've got a gland swollen up on this side now. Like, my lymph node's gone down on this side, and now it's starting to swell up this side. What is going on with my body? This top never used to fit me. Hey! <laughs> here he is, the man from China. Yeah. Oh, you bought me some... No, it's oh. for Dad. What do you mean it's for Dad? Because he lent me his car. Oh. Well, we've come down to Bournemouth. It's a very, very windy day. And we're struggling to find somewhere to park right now. No, what's the thing with parking then? Who knows, mate? Don't know. Where are you parked? Just down here. Oh, actually, look at that for a shot. That actually looks like we're in Spain. It looks quite nice. Look at the palm yeah. trees and the beach. It's lovely. It's lovely and warm. Yeah. Oh, just thought we're in Spain. You look like you're in Barcelona. Okay. Welcome, to welcome to Cribs. Check out my pub, mate. It's bush deers out. Oh, what? Shotgun the double there. I better have that when you pay. You're an hero, three. You've got a double coin, though. What's that noise? Me and you would have an hero. Oh, it smells like someone's literally just got out of the bath or the shower. It smells like it was used like a minute ago. Someone's knocking at the door. Somebody's ringing the bell. We've grabbed Adam with Uncle Aaron and then I'll be back later. All right, it's come to this. Come down to Bourne Porch, Russell Howard. We're in the pub. We're just winning money. Oh, you got to collect 100 quid? Oh, was it one pound? Big box, banker's offer, three pound 54. I don't really understand how these things work. Okay, here we go. I thought you'd take a photo. <laughs> Apparently, we're not allowed to film anything. Dad's got his beer. Um, well, put your phone away. Just got out of the Russell Howard show. Dad, how was it? Reasonable. Yeah, it was okay. I've seen better comedians, but he was okay. Now we come to the pub, a couple of beers, and a couple of games of pool. Neither of us have played pool for a long time and it shows. It took us about five shots each to even get a ball down. Two shots, he's playing a long game, isn't he? I'm down to one ball and then the black. See, he's still got four to go. But he's snookering me. Oh, it's a fine cut. Black's ready to go. So once I get that red in, we're good. 
Can you clean up? Please clean up. Watch where that white ball goes here. This is going to be interesting. Here we have Steve Blanford from Great Britain. What's he going to muster up here? He's worried about where that white ball's going to go. Look at the black. This could be the game if he's not careful. Ooh. Winner! Good game, son. Set him up. Second guy. One nil up. As either right. Off we go. Oh. Might be a red on for me there. Come on, let's see it. Oh. Oh, yellow's there. Half shot again for 2 0. Can't do that for the I've been very good this game. Looks like I'm going to pay for it. He's already got three there lined up waiting to go. There's another one. He's going to play lock, play short up in the far corner. And he's snookered himself. Well, not completely snookered, but you ain't going to get that one in now. Let's see what he does here. He's had a look at it. Oh, touch the res. Got VAR on that. Do the VAR. Show us the VAR sign. <laughs> to make it 2 1 in a tie, this is the last game, by the way, so either way. Nice. Pressure didn't get to him. Which pocket, son? Bottom right. Bottom right, not going middle. Bottom right as you look at it from here. Bit short, bit shy. He looks confident. Second bite of the cherry. Oh, I've got to keep that away, haven't I? Oh. You snookered me in the last game. Check your passport is valid for travel to Europe. Check if you have the right driving documents. And check your insurance You can't see it. You can't see it, look. Now look. You can't see it. Down, hey, this will be out of a shot. Did you hit the red first? Dubious, dubious. I think I did. Okay, the low level lighting is awful on this phone. You can just about see me. But um, what happened in that last game, Dad? I won. Yeah, but did you? Because we're not sure uh, whether the white ball hit the black first or the red first. And we can't, we've watched it back on the clip. But we can't quite see from the angle that I'm filming it with. We can't quite see which ball it hit first. But I'll give it to him. That was only a consolation game, though, wasn't it? Yeah. Two one. Two one. So I'll take that. But very rusty at ball. I've got to get better at that because I'll be playing that when I'm away. Okay. Sorry, this is a bit dark and you can't quite see me. But I'm in bed now. I'm going to end the vlog. Thanks for watching. Go and smash that thumbs up button down below. Leave a comment if you want to comment anything. I will read all the comments. Um, yeah. Remember, I upload. Every month, every Fridays and Mondays at 5 p.m. I remember, dream big and work hard.